Hello there everyone and welcome back for another mod review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Veltra T4 Pack version 1.0. The file size is 211 megabytes. Now the reason the file is so big is because all these tractors in the file are individual. You can't just buy one of them and change the color. All four of these are going to be inside the zip file so you just have to uh, unpack it and put them in. And actually I can imagine you can just put one in and get rid of the rest if you just want it one or two. So you, you get what I mean. And on the ground there, we're going to be taking a look at that as well. That's the Bennett DeVoise. I think I'm pronouncing that right. That is a seed and fertilizer and fuel refill. I don't see any fuel on it, but it will refuel your tractors and whatnot. And you can attach that right to your tractor. So I think that thing's fantastic. So we're going to take a look at these. We're going to go over and check out some of the specs at the shop. And then I'm going to test them out on the field. So, just let me come in for a landing here. I love the blue one. That blue just looks really sharp for some reason. I just like the way that looks. So, the Veltra T4 comes with 147 kilowatts and 200 horsepower. Now, these are all the same. 145,000 in the shop with an $80 a day maintenance fee. The max speed is 62 kilometers. And the Benesh Devoy refill is 4.84 megabytes. The price in the shop is $1,099 and a $2 a day maintenance fee. And like I said, you can attach that to the tractor and refill all three seed fertilizer and fuel. So let's jump inside and take a look. Oh, look at that, a demand for silage. Okay. These things are so sharp looking, man. I just love the look at these vouchers. I can't wait to try them in Farming Simulator 17 too. Look, you can see the refill icon in the bottom right hand corner. So you can already see that that is working. I'm not even that close to it yet. So let's look in. Right, we're going to test the lights and stuff first, of course. So F, get our lights. Oh, we can't get those ones in the top on? That's too bad. Let's try five. Sometimes five. There it is. If you press five on your number or your keypad over on the side, you can get them to come on. And your reverse lights, of course. It's funny it won't come on with F. Yeah, so just remember that. Five on your number pad on the right-hand side of your keyboard will turn on all your lights. We have some beacons. Horn. Signal lights, hazards, right on. Let's look inside. Nice looking interior. Cab looks great. We do have some IC controls. There's only two different ones. I do believe it's just the door and the back window. Pretty sure they're the only two. So we'll just leave that open. Yeah, not a bad looking cab at all. Do you have any animations here? Well, you know the speedometer works. Another thing with this, let's jump on in the outside and get out. It doesn't have any hitches on the front, unfortunately. But you can hook that right to the back, so it's not a problem. And you can open these doors from the outside with your R button. Or, yeah, I guess I wasn't close enough. Geez, that thing dirty already? I just drove it down here. Yeah, I like the blue one. The blue one just really sharp. I don't know about you guys, but I like that blue one. Cool looking uh, exhaust on it, too. I like the way it's bent like that. Really cool looking rig. I do believe the Veltra in the new one has bigger tires on it. At least it does. It looks that way in the picture. So... Let us jump in the blue one. Actually, I'll have to move that black one out of the way just so I can hook to that seed or that refill there. Let's see if I can say that correctly, guys. The Bennett DeVois. Now, I do believe that's, that's the way I think you say it anyway. So, let's hook, to the, hook that on up and we'll go test it out. And like I said, 62 max max uh, speed, 62 kilometers an hour. 
it is a nice looking tractor. It's only 200 horsepower, but I mean, it'll get all your small stuff done, such as spraying and all your light stuff. So let's bring this guy over here. There's the, uh, we're going to try out that cultivator because you only need 205 horsepower to pull that. So that's what I'll test it with. But I do want to test the uh, cedar stuff first. So just bring it alongside. So I mean, it's so easy to bring that to your cedar instead of like having to put a seed pallet down everywhere or have a dedicated vehicle for it. You know what I mean? You can just kind of tow it around with you. I thought that was great. So let's jump on out. Jump on in our JCB over here. So you can see the fuel icon is on there as well. Okay, I can't fill the cedar just yet. I'm probably just not in the right place. There we go. Just had to pull ahead a little bit further. I was surprised it did fuel as well because I only see seed and fertilizer on the back, but it will fill your fuel. And I think it's just great, like I said, that you can just take that with you wherever you go. And there's no, like, there's an endless amount in there. It just comes out of your money up top. So, we know that works. Let's bring it on over to our fertilizer over here, and we'll test that one out, too. I don't have any tractors that are empty on fuel, but you can see the icon in the bottom left, or right-hand corner there, so you know that'll work. And there's our fertilizer refill. Excellent. I thought that thing was fantastic. Such a small little mod, but man, that's going to come in handy when I... I'm adding that to my Let's Play, that's for sure. So we're filled here. Cool. Alright, we're going to jump over to another one. Let's take the red one. Since our cultivator is red. Go over and pick it up and then we'll try it out on the field. This one looks like it could be cultivated. We'll try it on this one or this field. We own both of them. Nice little tractor indeed. So we're getting closer and closer to release date guys. I'm getting really excited about Farming Simulator 17. I got it all pre-ordered. Pre it's the only game I will pre-order because my channel focuses on this game, so... Okay, we'll unfold. And let's lower them down. And start hacking. Alright, we're cultivating. It's pulling this with ease. Can we hire a worker? Yes, we can. So, short little review for you guys. Sorry there, bub. Got right in your way there, didn't I? That is the Valtra T4 Pack version 1.0 and the uh, Bennett Devo Devois. Sorry about that, guys. I'm having a hard time spitting that out. Additional information will be down below as well as the links. I hope you guys enjoyed this short review. Uh, hit that like button if you liked it, and if you're not. If you're new to the channel, maybe subscribe. I'm going to bring lots of reviews your way, and I'm going to be covering Farming Simulator 17 as well. So, until next time, take care, guys.